Hey guys, it's me, Tequila Dreams, or also known as Inspired Joe Men. Today I'll be doing what's in my makeup bag. So the first thing I have is this little compact mirror I'm probably going to do a DIY video about. Because I really like Sailor Moon's kind of accessories, even though I'm not really a girly girl that much. Kind of like in the mood. I found this, actually it was given to me by my sister, it was a hand-me-down. So I was going to actually make a DIY about it. Just like paint the inside, different color, and then do the outside, like the whole accessories. My next item would be this thing I actually got with a pack and I shared the mascara pack with my sister and this was one of the things that came out of it. And it might look kind of reversed when I show you this video, hopefully not, but it's supposed to be something you put on before, like a, like a primer in a way, I think. But I know it helps enhance the makeup, like keep it on there. Sorry, I'm still a noob. Next one would be NYX. I actually love this one. I don't know if you guys seen a lot of Ulzong, um or either anime tutorial makeups where they have the white eyeliner right underneath the, right the, at the eye dud kind of tear liner line, and you put it right underneath it. It's kind of like a crayon kind. So, and I got it for like two bucks. I think is my eyebrow brush and comb. I know it's a little broken. It's because I bought this at the Dollar Tree. When I was younger, but I like to keep things if it's very handy. I use this side more than I do this side. I keep it because I have really thick eyebrow eyelashes, which is good but bad because it gets stuck together sometimes, especially when I put on mascara. And I actually have two of these. It's the Maybelline New York Concealer. It comes out, it looks like a mascara at first, but you just put it underneath those dots and then I use my fingers and I pat it in. And it normally works for me and it makes me look very natural. I don't have any makeup on right now, but it worked. One of these are the old one, and I, it actually lasted me two to three years because I don't put makeup on too much. The other white um, pencil liner I was thinking about, it's more like an eyeshadow pencil, but I used it as for the tear liner. This came with a double side. It had like kind of like a like kind of a pad kind of brush where you can pat in your eyeliner and make a smoky eye effect. And then there's the pencil side. I didn't really use it because once again it irritated me. But I always keep it just in case I have a friend who wants to use it. Next item would be the Volume Impact Mascara. And that is what I use because it kind of helps my bottom ones. We can make it more volumizing as it was. I don't know why this is in my makeup, but I always keep this on me wherever I go. It is my <laughs> Crest Pro Health mouthwash. Oh, everybody's experienced this once. And you forget to brush your teeth and you run out the door and you're like, crap, my breath smells like but I really feel like fancy. I put this CoverGirl, um, let's see, it's called 395 Darling Cherry. It's more of like a matte finish, but it's still kind of pinky. And I know like, like, <laughs> it's like really bold, but for me it kind of fits in with my lip tone, so it kind of makes me feel like, yeah, I feel fancy. The next one would be my Burt's Bees Tinted Lip Balm called Petunia. It's 100% natural. And at first it comes in this like bigger box and then it goes to this tiny little thing and I was like, what's the purpose of it? I like this because it makes me feel like kind of very pretty but still doesn't like show too much, too much going on. My liquid eyeliner pencil and actually, well it's my gel eyeliner pencil but you can use it for whatever. I actually got this at Sally's for like a dollar, seriously a dollar. And it comes with a kind of a tipped point. I just keep my makeup very neutral so whenever I'm going anywhere I don't have to feel like I'm going to have to dress over the top every time I go. I actually mostly just use this one because everything else goes in my skin color. These two I probably would use the most, but these two I don't use so often because they are my skin complexion and you would not be able to see it. Mascara I was telling you guys about, I have volumizing and I have extra length strength. I thought that's my cat almost freaked out. <laughs> it's called the Extra Length Strength and it's by the Color Workshop. And it came in this pack and this was the, out of the three things I had, this was one of the three. And with two other ones I just showed you, which was the ex this is extra length, I had volumizing, and then I had the serum one. And I can show you what it looks like real quick. They all have a different way of, of stroking. This one's kind of like a little bent at the tip right here. The other one's more curved, the purple one I showed you guys. And I haven't seen the serum one because I haven't used it yet. Eyeshadow um, kind of gel liner. I like using gel liner because it's so much easier. You can use liquid eyeliner, which I request to use, but make sure you get the right ones because there's the ones where you have the wet on with the sink, you know, you have to wet it before you use it, and there's the other ones that you can just have, you just buy it and it has the liquid already in there, you just stroke it. That's the one I had, but god damn it, it, it ran away from me. Actually, I have a 
especially my skull <laughs> pencil sharpener, but I found it so much more useful for my makeup because I have another pencil sharpener. I was like, hmm. I think I actually got in another packet and it was from my mom and my sister didn't want it. And I have the I have the lip, lip liner pencils for it. And this is the lip gloss for it. And I don't know the brand name. Bellatrix. Sound like Beatrix from like Final Fantasy IX. But it's like a dual lip liner. It kind of comes out. This one doesn't have the actual pin thing on it, but this side does. Ooh. And it comes out like this, like the other like lip gloss kind of feel. And that's it for my glorious makeup collection. And I thank you guys for watching. But yeah. Um, I thank you guys so much for watching this. I hope you guys enjoyed it and this is like a first for me. So I'll see you guys. See you guys later. What?